Do you know what I'm talking about? Do you want to know what it is? Remember, all I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. The clip that you're just about to watch actually does go along with the video that I'm in the process of making and I think it's so important I need to show it. If you want to know how they're hiding the planets, and this is my theory, you need to watch the next video. It's really, really important. It shows and it makes absolute perfect sense of the technology they're using. But now I think I found an answer. What I would like to do is show you two clips and the first clip, the time of the clip is 6 p.m. The second clip is an hour and 13 minutes later, 7.13 p.m. It's for you to judge. Are we looking at a lensing system, a projection of a lensing system? That's exactly what I do think it is. And like I say, if you want to know my theory, my view, please watch the next video. Let's watch the clips. Well, another day, another sunset. And we'll look, like a, look at our sun, it looks like a sun simulator. Blue around the edges, white in the centre. Our sun is orange, people. Orange, orange, orange. But hey, and you've got that chemtrail haze hanging in the background. Nothing new there, then. All those particular looks. You, you can't really see the chemtrail, but they're there. You get to see the silver background up by the sun, and that's exactly what it does. That's what they used to obfuscate the That's what they used to obfuscate the planets, the objects in the sky. But there you go. Nothing wrong at all. And if we turn around the opposite direction, we can actually get to see the controls in the sky. And at one point, we actually get to see real clouds. Excellent. How do you? Really, just looking at this clip, you've got to ask yourself, what's going on? Part of the lensing system you're looking at. You've only got to look back five years. Really? <laughs> Come on. When... Did you ever sing this when you were a child? Never. Sun, rainbow, yeah. What is wrong with that picture? And what you're actually getting to see is the outside of the sky disc, the sun simulator, the lensing system. Yeah, and it's being projected onto the clouds, the chemtrails, the particulates that really do help us. Somebody made a bad error of judgment. But hey, who am I to say? And when you're actually looking at this, come on, let's be truthful. What part of this is right? Honestly, come on. Not one bit of it, I don't believe. There's nothing wrong in the sky. Weather's fine, the earthquakes are fine, just everything is fine. Nothing to worry about. I really do think we need to look at this very, very logically. And it goes really, really similar to this. This is what I believe is happening. We're looking at this and it's perfectly spherical. That was easy for me to say. And it looks like a lens with lots and lots of light going for it. Now, if you don't cover the outside of the lens, what you get is a bleed over and you get a prism effect. And that's exactly what we're looking at. Don't you agree? And if you want to know more, my next video is coming up. That tells you everything that I've learnt, how I've come to this conclusion. Much love and peace, and I'll catch you next time.